that's how I've been thinking too about our kids, man, you know, because, you know, my son's in ninth and my daughter's in eighth, you know. And I'd be wondering, like, if I'm not around and somebody just sees my kids out in public walking around and asks what they are, I wonder what my kids tell people. Do my kids say they're mixed or do my kids say they're black, you know? That's a weird thing about mixed kids, man. They never say white. I don't know what the fuck's up with that shit, you know? Now, I think my son will say mixed because we're close, we're tight. He's gonna represent his dad, you know? I, I honestly, I don't know my son's bright enough to figure it out, honestly. If you hem him up quick enough, hey man, what are you? Uh, 50 50, 50 50, 50 50. Oh, you're half black and half white? No, half mom, half dad. 50 50, yes, half my mom and half my dad. 50 50, 50 50. My daughter, though? Nah, nah, that's a black woman right there. My daughter ain't trying to be white at all. You gotta pry out of my daughter. Her dad's white. She just ain't volunteering that kind of information, you know? So I remember a couple years ago, they had like a daddy-daughter day at my daughter's school. So I go to her school, I walk in the classroom, right? The teacher goes, okay, whose dad is this? My daughter never stood up. She just looking at me, I'm looking at her. I was like, uh, motherfucker, hello? Oh, shit, I forgot, that's my dad. What the fuck you telling people? That's like my mom, my mom came to visit um, Christmas, right? My mom ain't seen my daughter in six months. As soon as my mom walks in the house, my daughter came walking out of her room. My mom was like, oh my gosh, look at you. You're getting so tall, you're thinning out, you're losing your butt. My daughter was like, what? She ran upstairs crying, I better not be losing my butt. I go, fuck mom, you just put her down, shit. <laughs> mom, in the black community, booty is beauty, okay? So you gotta go upstairs and apologize, please. <laughs> my mom was like, what do I say? I was like, onion. She was like, onion, and come on back down. She'll get it. You know. I'll tell you, though, I'll tell you when I knew, without a doubt, without a doubt, my daughter definitely considers herself a black woman was four years ago. She was nine years old, and this is when it hit me, right? I picked her up from school, and I had to take her home, and I had to take one of her classmates home also. So I got two nine-year-old girls in the back seat of my car, and I'm just driving home. And this is the conversation I hear on the way home. Little girl looks at my daughter and goes, hey, hey, do you believe in God? And my daughter's like, yeah, why? She goes, I saw this man on TV, and he said there's no such thing as God. My daughter went, Psst, I know there's a God, because when we were slaves, God was all we had. <laughs> I turned around, my daughter was like, did I say something wrong, Dad? Did I say something incorrect? I was like, I'm out of this conversation, shit. It's cause this shit with your mother's side of the family, shit. What made it worse is the other little girl, little white girl, she apologized. She looked at my daughter, you know, oh, I'm really sorry about that. My daughter was like, it's okay, you didn't know any better. I forgive you, I do. I mean, you can't forgive a nine-year-old for slavery. I don't think she had anything to do with it. That's why I, Listen, as much as I talk about my family Mac, I really gotta enjoy these last, these, these next, I don't wanna say last, these next four or five years because, you know, they're gonna, um, they're gonna be out of the house soon. They're gonna be in college, you know, and you know, well, I should say if my son goes to college. That's a big if at this point, right? But as somebody was talking the other day, I said, where do you think your kids will end up going to college? I said, well, my son will probably stay close to the house. He's close with me and his mom. He ain't trying to be too far away from us, right? My daughter though, nah, she's out, she's gone. If somebody wanna bet me money right now where my daughter's gonna end up in college, and she's in eighth grade, I will put money on it that she ends up at an HBCU. I just know her, right? But if my daughter ends up at an HBCU, gonna wanna make friends when she gets on campus, quickest way, join a sorority. If she joins a sorority, I means she's probably gonna be on a step team. I means she's probably gonna be in one of them step shows. Let me tell you something. If my daughter goes to a historically black college university and gets in one of them step shows, I'm gonna be at that first fucking step show, okay? First row, and everybody gonna know who the fuck her dad is that day. I be goddamn I'm paying all that motherfucking tuition. You gonna deny me? I don't give a fuck what color I am. They're sucking my goddamn check. You gonna acknowledge my ass, little girl, shit. I'm gonna be in the front row. I see you! I see you! I see you! Hey, isn't that your dad? That ain't my dad. <laughs> Dad, go! <laughs>